channel. I just saw something from my peripheral. What the hell was that? Okay. <laughs> so, I hope y'all are having an amazing day, an amazing weekend. My cousins and I, along with our children, we're going to a park to do just a cute little barbecue. And I have been wanting a hot link, well, mild link, for some time now. So I'm bringing mild links, hot dogs, hot dog buns, and the condiments. I, I brought water. I have um, sparkling water. Call me bro one more time. Is it bro? Not your bra. I'm your mom. Don't get it twisted. So, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. I don't usually like to be the first one anywhere unless I'm like hosting something. Let me get off. Or I'm about to miss my ex while I'm talking. here too so I'm hoping that we have a girl here oh I don't have any foil let me text her to tell her to get some foil in case we need some if she don't have it already we, go. we have arrived we're the first ones here I'm waiting for my cousin cousins yeah so walking my son around to this park Oh, this is the sucky part. You know, I... all right, you go ahead. It's it's right there. Keep keep going around. I need to see this part right here because I'm starting to see more shade now, and I'm thinking maybe we will want this part instead. Yeah, I'm starting to get more shade. Why are you walking so slow? Go. Jeez. So, I think we're gonna, I'm gonna move our stuff over here. Oh, and this one is way more cleaner. Yeah, gonna move my stuff over here. I'll be back. Keep an eye on me, y'all. Why would I do that? I'm here. Oh. Never mind, you guys stay here. Yeah. And we changed tables. For the reason why, Mom? Why? Mm -hmm. Because the grill is cleaner. We have our own private space. We're away from that party, and it's becoming more shade over here, so. It is? Yeah. Oh yeah, I can just go over there if I want shade. It's more shade. Sorry. I thought you were going to the park, but they just got here, they're right there. Yeah. This table needs to be wiped off. Yeah, see if she needs help with something. I'm so glad I moved. I think this is better. You see, it's nice and breezy. There they are. Did, did you see me just move from there? You saw me just move? I'm like, this is more, well, I feel like that's more. 
Yeah, you see it's about to be a party going on over there. I'm like, we're a little too close. <laughs> okay. I love my rice. It's more shade over there. I love there, my cucumbers. Where, where are we gonna make a cucumber, a cucumber salad? No, I bought some steaks and I just love eating like sliced cucumbers with any type of meat. Me and her just eat them like chips. Cute. You cold? You cold? She's over there shivering. Shit. Okay, uh, go to the park, mommy. Give me huggies first. Hey, okay. hey, mommy. Say hi to cousin Unique. And then I I might have to go so pretty. and order her some clothes. Say hi to your cousin and watch your sister, okay? You hear me? Okay. Don't leave the park. Cause now I might have to go buy Kane some pants. Cause I bought shorts, but I didn't bring pants. You guys gotta go around. Show them the way, Miles. Stick together. I know she's like walking over shivering. And I don't know what I was thinking, but I forgot that I got a little a popsicle. Well, that's why there is some sun too, so to keep her warm. Wouldn't she open? I'm a door dasher after you. Really? Hell yeah. It, you think she really needs it? Yes. <laughs> it's about to go down. We're about to have some fun. And we definitely got to catch up. There's so much that I need to catch her up on with my life. Like, there's so much that y'all need to be caught up on too Ooh, yeah lots you're recording on set right okay you, okay. you want me to <laughs> no no i just gotta remember to <laughs> be yourself you gotta be your... <laughs> please girl so i'm here with my favorite cousin on my mom's side who your favorite cousin on your dad's side i don't got many <laughs> <laughs> my cousin jodis you guys hey. have seen her Somewhere, right? Some some vlogs I post, some I don't. So I don't know. Um, is this vlog? Yeah. My favorite cousin on my dad's side is, will always be Brittany. Whether, oh, whether we talk or not. <laughs> um, no. One of my our friends was like, "Hey, give Brittany this," and I'm like, "Oh, I haven't talked to her." Uh -huh. <laughs> so and now she didn't come, but it was so lit. I see. I mean, well, if we could go back to our childhood and choose different things, then I definitely would do that. And then, especially to co go back with the, like, our mindset now, all that we know now, mm -hmm. and go back. But what about our parents, though? <laughs> you know what? I would go back only because, I would go back and take the same situation. Um, wait, I would take the same people if I can just control myself. Like I would've, I would've took my spot, number one, and got away from here. That's, that's all I would've, no, I probably wouldn't have been in the service. Would college. you? Mm -hmm. Really? That's one of my biggest regrets. Where? Not going to like, service. the army, the navy, the... I probably, okay, let me think about 18 year old Jonas. <laughs> 18 year old Jonas, I was fearless. Me too, um, those were the good old days. I would have chose the army. I would have chose the straight army. Yeah. Okay. That would have been cool. I can see you in the uniform. I couldn't do the uh, navy. I couldn't do the navy. I couldn't do the air. Because mm. the navy, you're out on the water. Right? Yeah. I would have chose the navy. The navy, they say, are the like. Oh. <laughs> the little pretty boy. <laughs> you know, like the punk. <laughs> um, I would, yeah, I would choose the navy or the. The Navy or the Army, but number one. And like, it's not like you gotta go and be out on the battlefield. Well, it depends at on that time, it was when our war had just started in 2002. You know, that was right after Twin Towers oh, and that all that nice stuff. Thing. And I have a few friends who went, but they never had to fight. Um, but they did have to go. But I, the only reason I would've went is to travel to school. Right. Like, Angela has stayed in China, she stayed in so many different countries, and you're there like working and, and living. living. And you ain't gonna know she even married a dude to take him with her. Like I'm like the most seven. That is so cool. And then you just work like your regular like eight hours or so. Yeah. And then you off and you can just enjoy the and day wherever you are. Oh, and then all the perks too, like free education. Right. Mm -hmm. You get a VA loan. Which what? With that, you don't have to put a down payment, right? Right. But they also have no down payment loans. But yes, they do have VA loans. 
uh, that you don't have to put down payment. Yeah, I could see that. Kyra, they called me one day for Kyra. And I was like, excuse me? <laughs> you wouldn't want her to go? Um, and I would want her to do whatever she wanted to do, but she decided to go. Um, not to go. Uh huh. Yeah, I like can him. definitely see Kai trying to go, and I don't even give a fuck. He would go to the, uh, he would choose the Navy. He might choose the Army. I, I don't want to be out on the water like, like that. Unless I'm on a vacation cruise. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be on the water like that. Just think, work. it's like a long ass vacation cruise. <laughs> <laughs> but, I, but you got to work though, huh? I don't, mm -mm. That would be interesting. If you guys can go back in time to your childhood with the things that you know now, would you go back? Would you change anything? I would definitely change some things. I would tell my dad, don't do that. So you can still be here with me. Don't go. So this is what we are working with. My cousin brought the essentials. So we're gonna clean this and we're gonna get to barbecuing. I can't wait, I'm excited. <laughs> deleted it but anyways I'm back home it is currently 8 37 it's getting late and dark so the footage that got deleted I was telling you guys how it popped in my head like about my ex and it was like a long distance and it didn't work out and after that I was like I don't want another long distance relationship but it, I was just thinking about the time where I surprised him because he lives in LA. I live, you know, in the Bay. So I had surprised him. I drove, I rented a car and I drove all the way to LA and I rented a room and I did like candle lights, like rose petals, like everything, champagne, on ice, like everything. Surprise him, and even though, and my friends was like, You really about to drive all the way out there and to surprise him, and he don't know you come on. What if he don't show up? I'm like, He's gonna show, 
like and I'm confident about that he's gonna show because why the fuck would I drive out there if I didn't feel like he wasn't gonna show but he did and it was just an amazing night and he was so happy to see me and he showed me how much like he showed me how much right so then I stayed that whole weekend and it was just a wonderful time like I ended up meeting his daughter that weekend um just it was beautiful so I ended up like messaging him and I brought that up because he always like brings that up too. Like it's just something that he'll never forget. And he's like, no one has ever done that for him before. So he'll bring it up here and there. So I brought it up this time. And I was just telling him how like a part of our relationship, um, I just felt like he wasn't putting in enough effort because he said that he was coming to see me and made up some excuse like, like he missed the flight or some stuff because he has like a buddy pass type of thing and it was that type of situation so he never showed up and I just wanted to for him to show that effort you know what I'm saying like put in the effort because I'm doing it I want you to do it too even though I'd much rather go to LA like SoCal is so much better than NorCal in my opinion and I live in Northern California so I know you know what I'm saying um, so I definitely like he really wouldn't even have to come over here but I wanted him to put in that effort and come at least once you know what I'm saying so I got all these pillows like bunched up here I need to move them so I can get more comfortable on light um but yeah so i had told him basically because we're doing voice chat so this is what i told him i was ready to come two weeks after you had left i was gonna come well that would have been nice because i really felt like you were putting in enough effort into our relationship and I felt like I was doing more, like driving out there, which I didn't have any issues with driving out there because I love to like drive and I love being in LA. So, yeah, but it, it would have been nice if things were reciprocated. You're exactly right. You're exactly right. I, I wasn't all the way reciprocating it as much as you and I, I that was stupid of me because I should have because I messed up and lost a good thing a beautiful thing and I apologize for that what do I say after that <laughs> like what do I say like yeah I'm so glad that he can take accountability you know what I'm saying <sighs> say that really means a lot to me it really does like I'm kind of speechless hearing you say that really means a lot to me it really does like I'm kind of speechless because I am I really, really am. <sighs> like, we talked about, like, traveling the world together. Like, that's the reason why I got my passport. Like, we talked about getting our passports, traveling, seeing the world together, and just being together. You know what I'm saying? Like, I work for the state. He works for the state. And he was saying that he was going to, like look for like work out here but I'm like I'd rather move out there like I'd rather move to SoCal I want to move to SoCal you know what I'm saying like, yeah just oh. 